Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So earlier this week, Microsoft held their Ignite conference, and at that conference, while giving a presentation, a screenshot was taken of that presentation, which revealed a couple of interesting new features that Microsoft could be testing internally for Windows. Now, this is that screenshot, which I actually did feature in a video I did post earlier today, where um, we looked at the floating taskbar with the rounded corners that seems to be hovering above the bottom of the desktop. And I'll leave a link in the description to that video. Now, regarding this screenshot taken from that presentation, um, according to a recent post by Windows Central, they are suggesting that this could be the first look at the next version of Windows, codenamed Next Valley. Now, as many of you may know, the current versions of Windows are codenamed Sun Valley. And as I have posted uh, previously, there have been rumors that uh, Microsoft could be planning to start releasing new major Windows versions every three years, be that Windows version 24H2, Windows 11 version 24H2, or Windows 12, although none of that has been officially confirmed by Microsoft. But I'll leave a link in the description to that video as it will just give you and provide you with a little bit more information. Now, getting back to this original screenshot, yeah, we can see it lacks a bit of detail and, and isn't a very high quality resolution. So what uh, Windows Central did was they uh, did a mock-up and they created this prototype, which is basically just a a duplicate of the original screenshot, but a, a much um, better um, quality as we can see. Now, yeah, at the top um, of the uh, screen, yeah, we see features um, available that are currently available in the taskbar. So yeah, we get the weather widget, which um, is normally found here and currently found here in the bottom left of the taskbar. Yeah, we get the search, which is also currently found uh, in the taskbar. But this search, this elongated rounded search box or bar is actually a feature that Microsoft is currently testing in the Windows 11 Insider program currently. So that's a feature that, that's not far off, so to speak. And then yeah, we get the, the uh, system tray arc icons that are normally found here in the bottom right of the taskbar. So at this stage, it looks like um, these taskbar these taskbar features that, that are currently available have been placed in a translucent bar at the top of the desktop. And um, according to reports, Microsoft is also planning to redesign other aspects of the operating system and features such as the notification center uh, for uh, the desktop and also the login screen. Now, um, this, uh, this uh, design, according to Windows Central, um, seems to be optimized um, for a better touch mouse and keyboard users all at the same time. So Microsoft is obviously trying to get a balance between mouse touch and keyboard users. And um, this is actually something Microsoft has been trying to do now for quite some time, where they, for the operating systems, they're trying to get a balance between desktop users, laptop users, tablet users, including those with foldable displays. And um, as many of you may know, um, when Microsoft released Windows 8, it was very focused on touch screen. And that's also back in the day when we had the um, the Windows Phone. So when Windows 8 rolled out, they were focusing on touchscreen devices. And then with Windows 10, it was went the other way, and then it was more mouse focused. And with Windows 11, um, you know they are attempting to find that right balance and get the balance right, so to speak. And um, according to uh, Windows Central, with this prototype and this mock-up, it seems that they are really now once and for all trying to get uh, the balance right, so to speak. Um, for desktop, laptop, tablet, and including foldable displays. Now, a feature Microsoft is testing currently, as I have posted previously, currently in the Windows 11 Insider program, is a tablet-optimized taskbar, which can be collapsed and expanded. So that's also a feature that is not far off. And um, at this stage, though, it's very early days for Next Valley. And as mentioned, um, Microsoft hasn't confirmed any of this, and this is just pure speculation and has been suggested by Windows Central. And as I always say with these screenshots, um, we always uh, take them with a pinch of salt. But nonetheless, I thought that was interesting. And just to keep you updated, as um, uh, this could possibly be um, the first glimpse, so to speak, of Windows 11 version 24H2 or Windows 12. Nobody knows. And obviously, there, there could be a lot of change between now and when the next version is actually released. But nonetheless, thought that was interesting. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.